the problem read, I have seven pounds of one type of coffee that's worth 35 cents per pound and five pounds of another type of coffee that's worth 47 cents per pound. I mix them completely. What is the price per pound of the mixture? Now, this is a mixture problem, but that's not the point. We're just going to solve it. So here is our solution. The first thing we always look for is what we need to find. So where's the question mark? Here's the question mark. What is the price per pound of the mixture? So that's a reasonable thing to use for our variable. So we define our variable. Let x equal the price in, what is it, in cents per pound of the mixture. So when we find x, we will have the answer to the problem. What kind of things can we ask Canal? Well, we know price per pound of the mixture. We probably want to know how many pounds of mixture do we have. So we would ask how many pounds of mixture do we have? And since we mixed them completely, we would have how many we have of the first type plus how many we have of the second type. We have seven pounds of the first type plus five pounds of the second type, which gives us a total of 12 pounds of the mix. So now what could we ask? How much is our mixture worth? How much is the mix worth? Not in cents per pound, but how much in cents? How many cents is the mixture worth? Well, it's 12 pounds times X cents per pound. So the answer to this question would be 12 pounds times x cents per pound gives us the pounds cancel, so we get 12x cents. And on the other hand, how much are each of the types worth? So the mix was worth this one. How about type 1 coffee? Type 1 coffee, how many pounds? We had 7 pounds. And it we actually know its price. It was 35 cents per pound. So the pounds cancel again. We have 7 times 35 cents. We get a calculator. 7 times 35 equals, so that's 245 cents. And now of type 2, we have 5 pounds, right? It costs 47 cents per pound. Again, the pounds cancel, so we're with 5 times 47 cents. Calculator. 5 times 47 equals 235 cents. Now, this was what the mixture was worth, and this is what each of the types are worth. So we can add these two together, and we should get this. So what is our equation? We have 12x, I'm not going to write the cents everywhere. We're just, we are going to check that all the units match. 245 plus 235. This was cents, cents, and cents. So our unit is cents, and that's good. So we have 12x equals, we need to add these two numbers, 245 plus 235 equals 480. So how do we get x? We divide 480 by 12, and that will give us x. Since 12 of these is 480, one of these would be 480 divided by 12. Calculator, 480 divided by 12 equals 40. So you would continue down. I have to continue over here. X equals 40. So we said once we got X, we had the answer to our problem. So the answer to 
to our problem is that the mixture costs 40 cents per pound. That's our answer. Does that answer make sense? Yes, it should be between the two because we mixed some cheaper and some more expensive. We should get a price that's between that. So our answer makes sense. Good old.